This might be the best all-in-one microphone for creators and honestly, even gamers. Hey guys, how's it going? Justin here from Waltz, and today we're taking a look at the AT2020 USB X, which is Audio Technica's new version of the 2020 microphone. Now they actually sent this out to me to give an honest review and test it out and see what I think about it. And instead of, you know, just looking at it and turning it around in a couple days, I decided to really use it for a couple weeks and give my honest opinion. So without further ado, here is the 2020 USB X. So normally we would do a sound test, but this microphone's so good that I don't even need to do a sound test. I can just use it as the main microphone for this video. Now, if you guys didn't notice, I actually already snuck this into another video earlier, a couple weeks back. This was the terrace video that I shot outside, which was really hard with all the background noise. But as you can tell, it sounds great. I'm going to play a little clip from that. It's very similar. However, it's been tweaked and made to be an outdoor TV with things such as 2000 nits of brightness, by the way, which we're going to talk about in a little bit. Now the Terrace comes with an anti-glare screen, which is going to be different than the other screens used on the regular lineup. And if you want to hear more from the outside version, you should go check that video out. I'll leave the link right here. But yeah, so I thought that was a pretty cool way to get a little early test on it. So this microphone is going to be a cardioid condenser microphone. And what that means is it's going to be at 120 degrees of audio capture. So mainly going to capture what's in front of it, but a little bit to the sides, nothing in the back. And as far as super technical specs goes, it's going to have a 20 to 20,000 hertz frequency response and a 16 bit depth. But something that's a little more impressive in my opinion is the zero latency monitoring. Now I want to talk about why that's important in just a second. But first, I want to kind of lay out the situation I got going on at my house and where this falls as far as my equipment goes. So for my normal setup, whether I'm at home or I'm here recording in the studio, I use an AT4040 XLR microphone, which requires a preamp. I use the Focusrite Scarlett 2, and I have to have that on a boom arm because there's no real mic stand for it. But because it's a dedicated XLR microphone with that 48 volt phantom power, it allows for it to be so deep and accurate. And the reason I bring that up is because that's something that makes this microphone special is that it already has that preamp. It has everything you need built into it and it's run through USB type C. So you basically skip all the costs of all the other equipment that you would need and it's just ready to go. It's easy. So as far as what you get in the box, you're going to get the microphone, that really nice stand and then a cord for the microphone, which also comes with a USB to USB-C connector, which is really helpful for me in this scenario because I have one of these new fancy laptops that for some crazy reason doesn't have a USB port, so I have to use those USB type Cs. So instead of me buying an adapter, it already comes with one. So I want to flip a U-turn and come back to the zero latency monitoring. And what's so cool about this and what I've gotten used to with my XLR microphone and preamp is that you can actually hear what you're saying and get an idea of what other people are hearing from you. Now, this might sound really weird at first because you're actually hearing yourself talk, but it really does make sense. And after you get used to it, it's something that you can't really get rid of. And why does that make sense? You might ask. Well, think about it. When your headphones are off, you can hear everything. And as soon as you put them on, you lose lose some of what you can hear. So the fact that you're hearing it with no delay, it just makes it sound like you don't even have headphones on. However, you still do, obviously, and you can hear your game through it as well. And that leads into the next point that I actually really do appreciate about this microphone is that it does come with different dials so you can adjust that headphone volume and then you can also adjust how much you want to hear yourself or the game. So if you don't want to hear yourself at all, you could just turn this off or you don't have to use the audio jack on the back. But that's personally what I like to do because then I don't have to run two cables to my computer. But yeah, I mean, this is something that's just it's it's the luxury of a preamp built into the microphone and it's really not raising the price of the microphone. It's pretty competitive compared to other models of different brands. So, I mean, overall, just awesome technology. Now, a little bit of a disclaimer, I do have to mention that this is only going to work on Windows 8, Mac OS or later and USB type one, which I'm pretty sure we're pretty past that. But just so you know, you can't run this on your XP computer. Oh, and you know, if you don't have that set of headphones that you're looking for, I really do recommend the ones that I'm wearing right now. These are the ATH M50X BT2s. And if you haven't already, go check our video out on that as well. These headphones are super nice. They're comfortable. And I couldn't recommend a better set of headphones for literally anything. 
Now, one other really cool thing about this microphone, and you know I'm a sucker for lights, is the fact that you can mute this thing on and off by the press of a button. But now you can, and you can tell when it's muted and when it's not, and it's super easy to see because it's it's nice bright and blue when you're not muted, and when you mute, it turns red. Isn't that awesome? Other than that, I think that's pretty much everything with this microphone. Thank you guys so much for making it to the end of the video. If this is a product that you're interested, make sure to email me at YouTube at Waltz so I can get you a special YouTube discount. If you haven't already, subscribe for more videos like these, and we'll see you in the next one.